forces that one into Surratt. Makes the catch and stays on his feet. He'll get into the end zone. Whoa. Well, there is not much you can do as a defense to stop that blitz coming from the top of the route. Let's look at the end of the play to see if he gets in. And it looks like he does. I want to see if that ball moves at all. Every yard is valuable. He's first and 10 now, so a new set of downs for the Hokies. McLeese squirts his way through. Touchdown. Line up in there, big man package, short yardage. And he stretches that ball out. Looks like it crosses the plane before any other body part touches the ground right there. And he gets the ball in for the touchdown. Empty backfield now for Newman. Another flag down, goes to the end zone. Touchdown, Surratt. Well, let's see what the flag Outside is. Offside defense, number 90. Penalty is declined. Touchdown. Starts from the slot position. You're going to see this happen more frequently throughout the game as Virginia Tech keeps taking away Surratt on the outside. Look for him to change his lineman, his position. A little inside fake. Football Hall of Fame. I said that Bud Foster would be a perfect uh, first one to ever do that because he's meant so much to college football. You like seeing this, don't How you? How about this? There's Trey Turner. Look at that speed. Inside the 20. We had a defensive slugfest in the first half. All of a sudden, now we're going up and down the exactly. field. Exactly. They uh, people made some half-time adjustments, I believe. So appreciated to the coaching staff here, Justin, and the whole staff for that uh, score. Uh, it truly is an honor. And you're pleased to see that. That's McLeese. Great patience in the backfield, and the hole opened up wide, and he just went right through it. Robinson or Wake Forest again in the ACC championship game. Green takes the spot. The pressure came up the middle, and Deshaun Crawford was there to pick it off. Job by getting skinny, getting through there, and putting pressure. In the Johnson two for two, make it three for three on the night. From 35 yards out, Hokies extend their lead. They have all night. It's Mitchell, and he'll score. And of course not, Mark. Praise from Bud Foster means a lot. He's gotten praise so far this year as a freshman. Hokies bring pressure. Surratt makes him pay. Almost a football, though. Still loose. Virginia Tech picks it up. They're going to say he was down. They're going to whistle this one down. And Surratt is down. Fourteen yards on the pickup. More importantly for... Field ...was a catch, and the runner was down. First down. The two other receivers out. Wake Forest 91 yards away. Newman, pressure comes, the ball's in the air, and it's intercepted! Dax Hollifield with the pick. How about that? Taiwan Garbutt loops around from his end position, and he knocks that ball, flutters in the air, and... Dax Hollyfield, who was on a blitz, saw the ball in the air. His eyes went directly to it in concentration to come down with it. Another interception from Virginia Tech defense. And another touchdown for Hooker. Celebrating the birth of his fourth grandson, Corbett. And he has more football left to play this season. I know he's looking forward to spending time with his family once this is over, but they have an ACC championship to win first. And you see that lunch pail defense has been so iconic, represented so much to so many players. And what better way to finish a night honoring Bud Foster than carrying him off the field, holding that lunch pail high.